What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power Play with CJ Prospect Profiles. So we're focusing on Renat Valiev of the uh, Kootenai Ice of the uh, Western Hockey League. He was actually uh, undrafted last year. I remember hearing a little bit about him. He was playing for the Ice, but a different uh, different Ice, the Indiana Ice, the USHL last season. I had 13 points in 36 games playing defense for them, and I had 43 penalty minutes to really show off the sandpaper in his game. He's not a bad size kid. He's about 6'1", 6'2". 190 pounds, and uh, you know gonna, you can avoid to see him fill out his frame a little bit more. But he's been kind of a well-traveled prospect. Obviously, I say he's playing for Kootenai right now. Played for uh, um, Indiana, the USHL last year, and then before that was in the MHL in Russia. So I mean, he's he's been to, he's been in a lot of places playing hockey, and uh, you know I think the sense of geography you know never hurt anyone. But um, you know I. I I'm kind of troubled the fact he wasn't drafted last year. I'd heard of him. I knew a little bit about him. And, um, you know, I would like to have seen him be, you know, a later pick. But, you know, he's had a, turned in a pretty good season with uh, Kootenai this year with uh, both points, uh, 28 points, 55 games, plus 27, 68 penalty minutes, you know, really kind of stuff in, stuff in the stat sheet. And uh, had nine points in 13 playoff games. So, you know, really kind of doing it all. He's, um,. Pretty good offensively. I mean, I think he's better offensively than his numbers may indicate. He's prone to inconsistency in his play. I mean, I know that was one of the knocks on him in the USHL. And, um, you know, I think he can afford to get better on the defensive side of the puck. You know, be a little more assertive out there more than anything else. But, I mean, I don't think he's a bad prospect. He's ranked uh, 83rd among skaters in North America. So, you know, maybe fourth or fifth round pick. You know, I think he's a good value pick. I mean, he's not a bad size kid. I mean, I know he was passed over last year. And, you know, that that's kind of brings a stigma with it, but I think uh, you look at what he is and see, you know, he, I think he'd help you, you know, down the line, and, uh, you know, he's nowhere near the NHL right now, but, I mean, you know, he, there's a you know, jump from the USHL to the, the Western League, and he's, um, you know, he's, he's playing well, so, I mean, I think he can, um, you know, I think there's still some upside with him, I'm trying to look up where he's from, he's from inland Russia, not exactly uh, near Moscow, we going east of Moscow, I'll just I'll look that up just for the geography buff in, in all of us, but um, again, you know, you, you send him back to the Western League next year, he plays on a pretty good Kootenai team, probably be you know, more focal point of the team with um, Sam Reinhardt all but assured to be in the NHL, I know Reinhardt's a forward I'm just saying, you know, in terms of being the selling point of a team in so many ways uh, which, you know, really doesn't have anything to do with on the ice productivity, but, you know, is what it is. And, uh, you know, and you see where he is from there, and I think, you know, he's kind of a long-range prospect, but for a kid that was in the USHL last year, you know, it's nature of the beast. I'm curious to see what the next step for him is. You know, is he going to take it to the next level next year, or is, he, or is his development plateaued? That's something that I think can be reasonably asked and, um, you know, makes him, you know, fourth or fifth round pick. Anyway, that's all I got in this episode of the Power Play with CJ Prospect Profiles. I'm Renat Valley of, of the Kootenai Ice. Stay tuned for episodes throughout the season, the playoffs, and beyond. Later, guys.